Mrs. Mamuni. Thank you so much for being Amar Baba Ma. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to discuss how many sub journals or day books are there and what is cash book. What are the features of cash book? What are the advantages of maintaining a cash book? How many types of cash book are there? What is the format of cash book? So let's get started. Cholo, shuru kora jak. Please remember when the size of the business grows and the transactions are numerous. It becomes very, very difficult to record each and every transaction in the journal. Yokun businesses size to khub bor hoye jay. Tokun ki hoy? Atu transactions hoy business hai. Yeta vishon difficult hoy record kora each and every transaction in the journal. And it may not be possible for a single person to record all the transactions in time. Ekta manushir pokhe shambhav na. Protita transactions record kora journally because numerous transactions occur daily. Okay, therefore the journal is subdivided into a number of sub journals or day books. Shijano ki kora hai? Therefore the journal is subdivided. Journal take divide kora hai into a number of sub journals or which is also known as day books. So, how many sub journals or day books are there? Number one, purchases journal or purchases day book. All the same. Purchases journal or purchases day book. Ki record kore? For recording only credit transactions. Purchases journal or purchases day book only records credit purchases of goods but no cash transactions or cash purchases of goods. Okay. Sales journal or sales day book means the same thing. Sales journal or sales day book records only credit sale of goods but no cash sale of goods. Okay. Number three, purchases returns journal or returns outward book means the same thing. For recording goods return to supply scale. J goods to purchase kore chila mamra, shitamra return kuchi supply scale but vendor ke. Shita kai bola hai purchases return journal or returns outward book. Understood. Ekhani shudhu purchases returns gulo record hai. Number four. Sales returns journal or returns inward book. Here only goods returned by customers are recorded. Ekhani jai goods ta sell hoi chilo. Shai goods ta jakhon customer return kore. Shita record hai. Understood. Number five. Cash book. Cash book only records cash transactions no credit transaction number six bills receivable journal or bills receivable book all the same bills receivable journal or bills receivable book only records bills accepted by customers number seven bills payable journal or bills payable book Bills payable journal or bills payable book only records bills accepted in favor of suppliers. When we'll do bills of exchange, then you'll understand more. Okay. Last. Number eight. General journal or journal proper. For recording transfers and transaction for which no other books of original entry is available. Understood? So these are the sub journals or day books. Understood because actor journal a to transaction record kora jaina. That is the reason journal has been subdivided into a number of sub journals or day books. Okay, now let's see what is cash book. Today we will only discuss cash book. Okay, what is cash book? The number of transactions is quite large in every business and it is quite difficult to record all cash transactions. So, jikono business a transaction onik hoi, onik cash transaction hoi. And it is difficult to record all cash transactions. So, cash book is the book which is used to record all cash transactions relating to cash receipts and cash payments only. No credit transactions. So, Cash book only records 
cash receipts and cash payments no credit transactions are recorded in the cash book cash book helps a businessman to know the balance of cash in hand and cash at bank at any point of time cash book businessman ke help kore janar jonno at the end of the period or hate koto cash ache ba cash at bank koto ache understood or hate koto cash ache ba or bank e koto cash ache kibhabe jante pare because if you deduct the total payments from the total receipts you will get the closing cash that is cash in hand or cash at bank understood when you see the format of the cash book then only you will understand let me show you the format of cash book this is the format of single column cash book two sides one is debit side another one is credit side cash book is nothing but a cash account we have already done ledger so cash book is nothing but a cash account cash book comes under real account what comes in is debit what goes out is credit understood so this is the format of single column cash book so cash book is divided into two sides one is debit side one is credit side this is the debit side and this is the credit side this is the column of debt this is the column of particulars or receipts this is the column of voucher number this is the column of lf or ledger folio this is the amount column so for credit same thing this is the column of debt this is the column of particulars or payments and this is the column of voucher number or v number this is the column of lf or ledger folio and this is the column of amount what is v number or voucher number on the debit side v number or voucher number means receipts number on the credit side v number or voucher number means payments number so all the receipts are written on the debit side all the payments are written on the credit side we have already done ledger cash book comes under real account cash book is merely a cash account cash account comes under real account according to real account what comes in is debit what goes out is credit receipt side is debit payment side is credit side inflow of cash will be recorded on the debit side outflow of cash will be recorded on the credit side understood all incomes are recorded on the debit side all expenses are recorded on the credit side understood this is single column cash book this is the format date particulars receipt side voucher number ledger folio amount for the debit side and on the credit side same date particulars but instead of receipt here will record only payments payment side voucher number ledger folio amount we have done a ledger account cash book is nothing but a ledger account and you know how to prepare cash account okay when we'll do cash book problem you'll understand now you understood cash receipts are entered on the debit side of the cash book and cash payments are recorded on the credit side of the cash book see cash receipts are recorded on the debit side of the cash book and cash payments are recorded on the credit side of the cash book understood so the cash book is merely the cash account because cash account is not opened in the ledger since cash book is a journal as well as a ledger since cash book is a journal as ledger cash book is a journal as well as a ledger so we don't have to open cash account in the ledger understood cash book is nothing but a ledger account and we all know how to prepare ledger account and we know how to prepare cash account because i've already taught you in the chapter ledger how to prepare cash account understood so cash book is very popular book and is maintained by all the organizations big or small when a cash book is maintained cash transactions are not recorded in the journal all the cash transactions are then recorded chronologically or date wise or directly for the first time in the cash book cash book er jonno kono journal hoy na je businessman ra cash book maintain kore tara kokhono journal e cash transactions record kore na tara directly record kore cash book e cash transactions chronologically that is date wise so journal e record hoy na so cash book plays the role of a journal and cash book is also see t shape cash book is merely a cash account 
we don't have to open cash account also we don't have to prepare journal we don't have to prepare ledger account so cash book is both a journal as well as a ledger understood so when cash book is maintained cash transactions are not recorded in the journal all the cash transactions are recorded chronologically or date wise or directly for the first time in the cash book cash book is therefore known as the book of original entry because all the transactions are directly and chronologically recorded for the first time in the cash book journal likha hoy na tai jonno cash book is also known as the book of original entry so that is the reason we are saying cash book is also a journal since cash account is not opened in the ledger account so cash book is also known as the principal book of accounts understood so in this way cash book represents the cash account also so cash book becomes the principal book of account cash book is both a subsidiary book or book of original entry and principal book cash book is a real account because what comes in is debit what goes out is credit because cash book comes under real account so cash book is mainly a cash account so and we all know how to prepare cash account understood only cash transactions are recorded in cash book all the cash receipts are recorded on the debit side all the cash payments are recorded on the credit side no credit transactions are recorded here this is the format of single column cash book so single column cash book only records cash transactions cash receipts and cash payments no credit transactions no checks received will be recorded here and no checks paid will be recorded in the cash book even no cash discount allowed will be recorded in the single column cash book or no cash discount received will be recorded in the single column cash book understood usually the debit side or the receipt side is greater than the credit side or payment sides and the difference will be written on the credit side as by balance cd suppose the total of debit side is 1 lakh and the total of credit side is 80000 So, if you deduct eighty thousand from one lakh, by balance CD will be twenty thousand. Understood? And in the next accounting period, the balance twenty thousand is brought down on the debit side beneath the debit total by right by balance BD twenty thousand. We have already done this in the lecture. I hope you remember. Okay. So, what are the features of cash book? the features of cash book are as follows number 1 only cash transactions are recorded in the cash book chronologically or date wise as they occur cash book ke key record hai only cash transactions chronologically or date wise record kara hai as they occur number 2 all cash receipts are recorded on the debit side of cash book i have already shown you all cash receipts are recorded on the debit side of cash book and all cash payments are recorded on the credit side of the cash book okay see all cash receipts are recorded on the debit side of the cash book and all cash payments are recorded on the credit side of the cash book number 3 cash book is both a subsidiary book why because it acts as a journal or it is also known as the book of original entry can you because जखनी ट्रांजेक्शन अकर कर तक ही डिरेक्टलि क्रोनोलजिकली कैश बुके ट्रांजेक्शन रेकर्ड है जार्नले रेकर्ड है ना एंड द प्रसिपल बुक अल्सो वाई बिकज कैश बुक अल्सो एक्स एज अ कैश अकाउंट सो वी डोट हैव टू ओपन कैश अकाउंट इन द लेजर नीदर वी हैव टू प्रिपेयर अ जार्नल नीदर वी हैव टू प्रिपेयर अ कैश अकाउंट सो कैश बुक एक्स एज a journal and as a ledger cash book is both a subsidiary book because it is known as the book of original entry since all the cash transactions are directly and chronologically recorded in the cash books and not in the journal and it is also known as the as a principal book since cash account is not opened in the ledger 
okay or since cash account is not opened in the ledger because cash book also acts as a cash account okay so cash book is both a subsidiary book that is the book of original entry and a principal book so it performs the functions of both journal and ledger at the same time understood now what are the advantages of maintaining a cash book cash book er advantages ki the advantages of maintaining a cash book are as follows number 1 both cash and bank transactions can be recorded in the cash book cash book e both cash transactions are record kara jabe and bank transactions are record kara jabe we don't need journal for recording cash and bank transactions okay number 2 Cash book prevents duplication of work in entering cash transactions in the journal and posting them into the ledger because cash book is journal as well as the ledger and when cash book is maintained no separate cash account is opened in the ledger kono duplication hoy na keno hoy na because jokhoni cash transactions occur kore directly cash book e record hoy journal theke record kore abar cash book e record kora hoy na to shekhane kono duplication hoy na similarly कैश बुक थे लेजर अकाउंट खुलते हैं बिकज कैश बुक इट सेल्फ इज अ कैश अकाउंट तो वोने कैश अकाउंट रेकर्ड हो जाए सो कैश बुक एक्स एज अ जार्नल एज वेल एज अ लेजर तो कि है इट प्रिभेंट्स डुप्लीकेशन अफ वर्क अंडारस्टूड नो जार्नल इज प्रिपेयर एंड नो कैश अकाउंट इज ओपन इन द लेजर कैश बुक एक्स एज अ जार्नल एंड लेजर एज वेल Understood? Number three, cash account is not opened in the ledger. I mean, again, I told them, cash book acts as a cash account. Cash book is nothing but a cash account. So we don't have to open cash account in the ledger. Neither we have to prepare journal nor we have to prepare cash account. It prevents the size of the ledger from becoming too large. ये तो cash account खुलता होए ना. ताज जो ना क्यों है? Ledger का size टा बड़ो है ना आलदा और कैश अकाउंट खुलते हैं ना बिकज कैश बुक ही कैश अकाउंट नम्बर फोर इट हेल्प द बिजनेस मैन टू फाइंड आउट द डेली कैश एंड बैंक बैलेंसेस विदाउट द यूजल डिले ऑफ पोस्टिंग फ्रॉम द जार्नल तो जार्नल थे लेजर ट्रांसफार करते हैं ना ना इखने जार्नल प्रिपेयर करते हैं ना इखने लेजर प्रिपेयर करते हैं कैश बुक प्रिपेयर करा मान जार्नल क्ज कर लेजर क्ज कर तो बिजनेस मैनरा फाइंड आउट करते डेलि कैश रिसिप्ट कत हो कैश पेमेंट कत हो कैश बैलेंस कत बैंक बैलेंसेस कत को डिले ओर है ना कारण ओर जार्नल वेट करते हैं लेजर पोस्टिंग वेट करते हैं अंडारस्टूड नम्बर फाइव सिन्स कैश एंड बैंक ट्रांजेक्शन कन्स्टिट्यूट अ मेजर पोर्सन अब द एंट्रीज इन एनी बिजनेस therefore the cash book is very useful and results in economy of time and labor jikono business e major portion hoche cash transactions credit transactions kom hoy therefore since journal o prepare korte hoy na ledger o prepare korte hoy na because cash book acts as the original book of entry as well as the principal book of accounts cash book is a journal as well as a ledger that is the reason cash book is also known as a जार्नल सो डबल कलम कैश बुके तीन टे नम्बर वन एक कैश कलम एंड डिसकाउंट कलम नम्बर टू बैंक कलम एक डिसकाउंट कलम एक नम्बर थ्री कैश कलम एक एंड बैंक कलम एक अंडारस्टूड नम्बर थ्री ट्रिपल कलम कैश बुक और ट्रिपल कलम कैश बुक ट्रिपल मीस ट्रिपल ट्रिपल मीस थ्री थ्री कलम्स हाविंग थ्री कलम्स एक कैश कलम एक बैंक कलम एंड एक डिसकाउंट कलम थ्री कलम्स नम्बर फोर पेटी कैश बुक पेटी कैश बुक इज अ सेपरेट चैप्टर ऑल टूगेदर आई बी डिस्कसिंग पेटी कैश बुक वेन आई टीच पेटी कैश बुक बट एनी वे लेट मी टेल यू वॉट इज पेटी कैश बुक पेटी कैश बुक इज मेनटेन्ड बम फर्म्स फॉर रेकर्डिंग पेटी एक्सपेन्सेस पेटी मान 
petty means small as per your syllabus only single column cash book that is cash column only and double column cash book that is number 3 cash and bank columns and petty cash book are there no cash and discount columns are there as per your syllabus no bank and discount columns are there as per your syllabus only cash and bank columns are there and triple column is not there in your syllabus so this is the format of single column cash book i hope you understood thank you so much for watching thank you so much for your precious time i sincerely hope this was helpful and before i fade out please remember every successful channel on youtube had zero views zero likes and zero subscribers in the beginning so don't give up just work on your content keep working just focus on your work work harder please don't feel sad be happy that you could contribute at least something to the world in your own small way bye bye take care stay safe and stay blessed always